Great news. Long Island just entered phase two of the real estate reopening. What does that mean for you, the buyer or seller? Yep. Great news. Like I said in the intro, phase two of the Long Island real estate reopening is in effect right now. So what does that mean for you, the buyer or the seller? It means that we, the realtors, are allowed to do open houses. We're allowed to have face-to-face -face meetings with buyers and do private showings of your property. But we need to follow strict CDC guidelines as outlined by NICER, which is the New York State Association of Realtors. Some of those guidelines I'm going to share with you, and I'm also going to put a link to the guidelines so you can see exactly what they are. Number one, the house must be vacant. If we're doing an open house, it needs to be totally empty. I don't mean the furniture needs to be gone, which would be good if it, you've already moved. However, the house needs to be vacated by the owner and all the people living in there during the showing, whether it be an open house or we're doing a private showing for a uh, potential buyer. Number two, everybody entering the house needs to have proper PPE, whether that be a mask like this or some sort of face covering. And if the homeowner requests and, and or the broker, proper gloves on the hands and also uh, booties on the feet. So we can show the property it needs to be vacant. We have to limit the amount of people into your property, stagger it out. If there's people coming for an open house and we have large numbers outside, they have to be spread out naturally for social distancing. And after the open house is over, naturally we have to disinfect everything that has been touched. So a tip for the homeowner is to make sure you open up all your doors, all your cabinets, so things don't have to be touched. Naturally, buyers should not be touching anything except when necessary, like railings, on um, staircases and doorknobs if they weren't open and the realtor will disinfect everything after they leave and also i would suggest that the homeowner go out and disinfect things better safe than sorry so basically as phase two is open we are now starting to show properties it's suggested that most of the showings be done online safety is the most important thing virtual showings are the safest way to show a property. So I encourage all homeowners to make sure that their realtors show the property virtually as often as possible. If people still like the property, then we can invite them for a private showing following the CDC guidelines that I just outlined. I hope you enjoyed the video. Definitely give me one of these if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. This is Mark Schreier from Century 21 American Homes, and I'll see you on the next video.